Atlanta, I want to share my experience today as I got my cortisone shot and to let you guys know if that's something that you're looking um, to do or something that's recommended by your doctor. I want to say it's not as bad as it seems. I know on my videos I'm a little dramatic, but it really was a quick stick and prick and it was over with. Once he did the, um, the numb and spray, and as you can see, Dr. Savanoa went in and out really quick. So by the time you think about it, it's over with. And as for me, I mean, it was just my tendons that was acting up. It wasn't carpal tunnel, it wasn't anything like that. Um, thank God. But for you who are maybe rethinking the process, because I looked at the videos um, prior to me coming here uh, yesterday and I almost rescheduled. I'm like, ooh, maybe I should rethink it. Maybe I should just like not use my right hand at all. But I'm just saying it really wasn't as bad. So don't not do it based on the videos that you saw, um, which are the ones, some of the ones that I've seen. Um, but I know to each his own and everybody's different. But but I would say, you know, give it a shot. Because again, it's not, you know, it wasn't, it wasn't that bad. It wasn't what I was expecting. I didn't really know what to expect because I know, you know, everybody different. But I'm just saying, you know, if you're nervous, take a friend with you, take somebody, you know, some support with you if needed but as you can see it's really quick you're in and out so if that's something that's recommended you may want to rethink it good luck i'll keep you posted on my results hello my peeps and people i'm back at the doctor's to get my cortisone shot in my right hand so look again i see the needle okay i'll keep you posted I'm gonna try to video it, but I'm not sure if it's possible. I feel like somebody's standing over me. I'm next. I'm waiting. See? More eating. Uh, to numb your skin, it's very cold. That will run down. That looks pretty cool. Uh, but that looks a lot so you don't feel it as much. First thing, I'm just going to mark the spot and prep the skin. Hello, my peeps and people. I am about to get my clothes on shot, so you guys get to see me cry. And by all I don't know means. if you want to. I don't know if you not want to be in there. Or... Oh, it doesn't matter. Yeah, just. Oh. Uh, it's fine. I just need to have you positioned, and so you can relax it, and so it doesn't move. Can you turn it so I can see my hand? Yeah, let me just get you positioned here first. So, move that up. So. Can you take them off? Oh yeah, I just want to have your hand kind of flat. Just kind of tuck that elbow a little bit. So I'm just going to kind of mark the spot here first. You feel that little pop? I'm moving it back and forth. I don't know if you can feel it pop in there. No. Make a little mark here on your skin. When I go in. This is a little pressure to mark the spot. And this is to prep your skin. That cold spray will run down. So that's not in the bone, is it? Is that the... No, no, I'm not going into the joint or into the bone. This is along uh, the tendon there. So can you see that? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Just uh -oh. turn your hand this way. There you go. So first thing is the cold freezing spray. Right after the cold freezing spray, you'll feel the little needle stick, a little sharp, little pressure and burn. Cold, wet, numbing freezing spray. Yeah, the cold spray is very helpful. Needle yeah. stick, sorry okay. about that. Little pressure and burn now. We are almost done. Hurts, but just for a second. So I was able to get it right where I needed to go. Everything went well, just kind of a tender spot for a shot there. It wasn't that bad. Yeah, if I can get right in and get out pretty quick and that small needle, freezing spray, lidocaine, all that oh, helps spray. a lot. So the lidocaine, sometimes you'll get a little numb sensation to your finger. Uh, that'll only be there for a few minutes. That'll wear off. The cortisone does take a couple days to kick in. Okay. Once that cortisone kicks in, you should see good improvement there. 
Uh, and once you start to see the improvement, I do want you to work on the bending, try and get it fully bent, fully straightened. Do you still recommend I wear the brace? Because I haven't really been wearing it because A, it's big and it doesn't really do much because it's, it's big. But no, that you, was the smallest they had. Yeah, you don't have to wear that. Okay. Um, so just to, to avoid the aggravating things. Okay. And you can sit up whenever you're comfortable there. Well, that was it. I made it. Yeah, I didn't really wait. Uh, right up front here. Take the time. Thank you. Oh, sure. <laughs> I did it. Well, we'll see how it works. Maybe I should use my thumb. Well, apparently I survived and got my shot. Still kind of numb, but we'll see. So I just want to say that was my protégé shot. So love you mean it, but I'm doing it. I'll pray for you. You pray for me. I need it.